All right, hey. Good morning from Lowe's, bright and early. Beat the line, and folks, bong. Another new vanity. This one was $1.99. Got a bunch of painting stuff that we need, some plumbing stuff, some fence repair screws, and a whole bunch of stuff that we're gonna need over at the house. Got the trusty trailer because we don't got the box truck no more. It's almost time for the Bobo. So I need to hurry up and get loaded up, get back to the Bobo, and then folks, we're going over to the house to paint. Exciting times. All right, what a pain in the ass that was. Trying to get this damn strap over this vanity. Uh, you're probably wondering to yourself, Joe, don't we already have a vanity at the flip house? And we do, but it's been damaged and that ain't no good. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get that vanity up out of there, try to put that up for sale. That was a $400 vanity we bought. It's now $600, it was on sale. It's got scratches in the marble, uh, nicks in the wood. So I'm gonna try to get at least like 200 bucks out of that. Put that on Facebook Marketplace, something like that. It's like 9.02, I'm supposed to be doing the Bobo right now. I'm gonna try to get back to the house and do a little bit of a late Bobo. And then we're off to the house to paint. I started painting over there yesterday and it wasn't very easy. So I had to get some supplies to help make this job a little bit easier, get some rough rolling brushes, which I did, and then also get, I need to bring some lights over there. That's another thing that I need to do. Also, real quick, just to let you guys know, I don't think I've updated you on video in terms of where we stand with who actually owns the house. Folks, we own the house. There was an issue with the deed, and I ended up getting in contact with the default closing specialist at the closing company, and he got the situation resolved. So the deed has been sent to be recorded, and then soon enough, we're gonna have the physical copy of the deed and the title. It's hot as hell today, the camera's fogging up, so I'm gonna wrap this up for right now, and let's see where this day takes us. All right, what a time. So it's 11.30, just got done filming and we're getting on the grind. It's time to go paint, to go put this new vanity up in the house, and I'm gonna get some help today. Rabbit's gonna be joining me. I went over there yesterday to begin painting, and I'm not gonna lie to you folks, it is not easy to paint over that texture. I started on the ceiling, I didn't have a lot of light up in there, I don't honestly know how well that's gonna look. I went to Lowe's this morning, not only did I get the vanity, I got some kill stain blocker because we've got some stains that need to get blocked and then i got some very rough rollers so hopefully that's going to make this job a little bit better and i've also got lights in the back of the truck as well so we'll have lighting but let's get over to the house let's see what we can get done and let's make it a good one. Oh, and there's a lot of work to show you guys too the house is actually starting to look pretty good hopefully you guys will be impressed so let's go see what you got in the box? Hey, what's going on, everybody? He got strapped down in the box, man. Another vanity. Oh, no. oh that's the other vanity? Yeah, that's the new one. Right. I thought you had already took it to the house. <coughs> no, I've been. How's it going? Hey, man, what's going on? How about yourself? Oh, man, not too bad. Oh, I've seen better days, but, you know, I've seen worse too, so. I saw your roommates out there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Rabbit, you know anything about painting? Uh, I've done a little painting a time or two, yeah. Well, we got some painting to go do. All right. Uh, what's going on with you, man? You ain't working today? No, not, not working today. Uh, I, I'll talk to you about that a little later on. But, um, no. Uh, I mean, everything's good at work, you know. I, you know, I still got my job and everything. Just, uh, uh, the, uh, there's, the, the area where we're working at is, um, like a, school you know i don't want to really right go into it but you know and we can't tear the yard up back there at the property so we, you know we can't get our machines in there is this only diesel no it is only diesel is it yeah ain't that something I thought that they were diesel and gas i guess that one's uh, only diesel all right. Gas, all right let's get some gas and then we'll get the show on the road hey it's good to see you man sounds good man hey, man it's good to see you both it's good to be here hell you yeah know, i always love to work and it doesn't matter really what kind of work it is well we got some work today let's make it happen all right we are over at the house 
Can't remember the last time I showed you guys what was going on over here, but a lot of stuff has gone on. We've got the trim down. Trim is cocked up, minus what we got to do around these outlets. Trim around the bar. Looks really good. And boom. Rabbit getting ready to shake up some paint. And here we go. We got that nice peanut butter beige right there that we're going to be putting on these walls. Hopefully that's going to look real good. I think it will. We got some lights up in here. Found some more lights right there, so that's good. A couple of cabinets that have been put together. And we're ready to get this kitchen put together, but we got to paint this wall. Uh, you can see a little bit of the white paint right there, maybe. I was in here painting the ceiling yesterday, and you're probably not going to be able to tell nothing on that. The camera doesn't want to focus on anything, but I'm looking at it. I don't see any spots for real. So I'm guessing I did a pretty okay job. Oh wait, I see a spot right there and a spot right there. So I need a brush. Yeah, so we got some brushes. We got all our paint supplies over here. Good Lord, camera focus. Focus, there it goes. All right, so the game plan is, let's try to cut in this wall right here. You're probably wondering to yourself, Joe, why the hell didn't you just spray this place? Well, I like to work harder, not smarter. So we're gonna roll this money. And uh, hopefully that corner, that lip between that ceiling and that wall is gonna be real high and tight. Nice and sharp. There you go, you can see that white paint that I got going on. Uh -huh. You think it's gonna come out good? Most definitely. We got the vanity in the bathroom. We've got the hallway done. Boy, look at this hallway though. Hallway is done, looks really good. Bathroom is ready to go on. We'll be patching up that hole, getting some lights going. Man, by the end of the week, I think we might be done. That AC's blowing, I know that. The cups for the paint? No, I didn't, but we can use a paint tray. Yeah. So, all right. Yeah. You stirred that up real good, Rabbit? Oh, yeah, she's good. You sure? Yeah, check it out. I also got some heavy duty rollers. I didn't have the right rollers up in here yesterday, so that made the job even harder. Yeah. So, he's good. all right. Well, folks, we're getting ready to start painting, and the next time you see it, hopefully, this wall is looking crisp. Oh, yeah. All right. So we cut in this top. Looks pretty good. Oh yeah. Pretty straight. I'll tell you, there's probably a couple of mistakes right there, but you guys can't see them. A little spider on the wall. All right, so we're gonna get ready to start rolling the walls. Rabbit's gonna cut in around the window, and let's see how this is gonna work out. Using the brush, the wall is just eating this paint up. So hopefully using these bigger rollers, gonna help saturate this wall oh my god are my arms tired uh, I got two brushes here I got one, one with white on it there's a brand new brush it's a black handle brush right here. yeah that one let's use that one all right, all right folks uh, I don't know if you guys can tell probably not you can't tell anything from this I'm gonna try to take some pictures and hopefully the pictures will do better so maybe you can see, yeah, you can see it a little bit. Corners are something to be admired. Definitely needs a second coat in here. The back wall hasn't been done. There you go. You can see the color difference right there. Mm -hmm. And we're getting it. Hand painting all of this. All right. Well, it's a little bit like Groundhog's Day. Sorry that yesterday kind of ended abruptly. Good reason for that. The battery died on the camera and I didn't have any extra batteries. The first day that I've not had batteries. I was running around too fast and I forgot to bring extra batteries. So I didn't get a chance to wrap up yesterday's video. So we're just gonna continue it with today. Getting ready to head over to the flip house again. Getting ready to pick up Rabbit again. He's gonna be helping me. And getting ready to be doing more painting. I need to do a second coat of paint in the kitchen area and we're also going to be putting up some lights. I've got three lights, the living room light, the middle room light, 
or the middle area light and then the kitchen light. Those three lights are ready to go up. Rabbit's gonna help me get those lights put up while I'm doing the painting. And also there's probably some other work that's taking place over at the house. Folks, not this week. It's Wednesday as I'm filming this, but by next week, we're gonna be done. I'm confident in that. We've got enough work going on and enough things taking place and I'm really putting the ax to the grindstone. Is that the way, is that the right way to say that? To make sure that we get this damn thing done so we can get this thing on the market and hopefully sell this place. Do you think we're gonna be able to sell this? How long do you think it's gonna take? What will we sell it for? There's a lot of questions right there that are yet to be answered. But I know you're gonna think this is crazy. I've already found what I think is the next house. So look at this monster right here. Three bedrooms, uh, one and a half baths. Nice looking front to this thing. And I mean, obviously it needs a shit ton of work, right? So it's not a bad looking house. Pretty big house, to be honest with you. The siding doesn't even look too bad from this picture. So here's the fireplace. Don't know what's going on with that. Uh, they decided that, you know, they didn't want a fireplace, obviously. There's some shitty ass carpet in here, some crazy colors to the wall. We got the bay windows. Well, it's not that big of a living room, but it's nice enough. I mean, shit, the house that we got now was way worse than this. All right. And at least it has some, and look at this. I mean, this ain't bad. Dining room. There's the kitchen. Now, trust me, folks, the kitchen is going to be horrendous. Like, I don't know what they got going on up here, but there's definitely a lot of room for improvement for this kitchen. Yeah, we could probably even knock out a wall. We could do this shit like a real, like a real, like a real ren reno. Ain't that what they call it? Ain't that the word, reno? You know, we could knock a window down, have a bar. Maybe bar tops with the drop-down lighting will be like our signature feature. You know, like the magnolia trees for uh, that husband and wife? I mean, obviously, all this shit's got to go. You know, what do we got going on here? We got some water pipes going on, just running straight exposed through the wall or outside the walls. It needs a lot of works, uh, a lot of work. So there's the kitchen. Here's another image of the kitchen. That floor, I can already see that slope. Look at that. We got a little freaking skate park right here. Wing, boy. Hit the nollie flip in that kitchen. All of this would go. We'd bring the refrigerator in, first thing smoke, and put it right here in front of this window. Bung. Right? It's not bad. 45000 for this monster. What in the god damn is all... Is this the mother... Plumbing? <laughs> oh, shit. I like that house. And hopefully if we are able to get rid of this one, we can move on to Felon Flipper's house too. But that's still out there in the future a little bit. Let's go ahead and get to the present. Get this painting going. Get these lights hung up. And hurry up and get this damn house done. <sighs> Had to change the camera. The other camera broke. Damn, we are down to like no cameras. Come on, man. I'm coming, man. I'm coming. <laughs> hey, welcome to Groundhog's Day. Same thing as yesterday, just a different day. Hey, that's a good thing. You know, if, um, if we could have Groundhog's Day every day, then you would never have to worry about where you was going to work at. You wouldn't have to, never had to worry about where you was going to live at. Everything be the same all the time. You wouldn't have to worry about bills. Uh, that's not a bad way to look at things, Rabbit. Way to be optimistic right there. How you feeling today? I feel pretty good, man. Uh, I'm uh, motivated about 110%. There you go. You know, and, uh, How the hands feeling today? I tell you what, look. You remember how swollen they were yesterday? You couldn't see the bones or something? I can see the bones now. Yeah, that one's still swollen somewhat. But that, yeah, the swelling went down, man. And this one, this one had. Man, I tell you what, buddy. I, I just don't know what to do. Well, but I'm gonna get it figured out. I appreciate you helping me with the painting yesterday. That was a little back breaking. Yeah, well, I mean, it wasn't all that bad, man. You know, it's, once we got started, it was a just straight roll. Yeah. I'm gonna have you doing something different today, Rabbit. Uh, Working on lights. I, Hell yeah. Hanging lights. Hanging lights. We got three of them, and then uh, after we get those done, we got some other stuff too. So. Okay. That sounds like a one. Appreciate your help today. Oh yeah. We're gonna make it a good day. Yeah, most definitely. As long as you don't hit that big ass truck. Yeah, let me go ahead and get the hell out of that way. Yeah. All right, let's get over to the house. I think maybe these old cameras might actually work better in the house. Or maybe it's just the fact that we don't got the light on in here. All right, so we're back over at the house and we're getting ready to start putting up the lights. So Rabbit's pulling out that first light right there. 
That's gonna be the middle light. We got a ceiling fan going right there. And then we got a regular old dome light going in the very back. While Rabbit works on that, I'm gonna be doing painting. I'm gonna hit this kitchen wall another time. That way the kitchen is completely ready for paint. And damn it, that never got done neither. So, crazy story, our outlet for our range, our outlet for our stove, is buried behind this sheetrock. I didn't bring the sheetrock knife, so we're gonna have to figure that out. Once we get the second cone of paint on this wall, the kitchen is then ready to be installed. And I'm also gonna hit some of these crazy marks right here that definitely just ate the paint up, touch up my corner line, and then work my way around the rest of the house. So that's what I'm gonna work on. Rabbit, you sure you know what you're doing with the lights? Yeah, yeah I got it. We brought Rabbit the, uh, the high chair so he can get up there. And it is time to make this place look like a home. Share with you guys in a little bit how things are going. We've already kicked one breaker too, so hopefully things work out. All right, probably only been on it for about 20 minutes. And Rabbit's already got this first light getting ready to be completely mounted. He's putting the bulbs in it right now, trying to figure out how that works. And we're gonna see if that worked. I asked Rabbit if he wanted to test the light before getting it put up there, but he says, no, nah, he don't have to do that. He knows he got it right. While he's been doing that, I've been over here getting some fresh paint on the walls. And one thing that I'm noticing, or at least I'm hopeful of, is I'm not really having to put a whole hell of a lot of paint up here for my second coat. I am putting a whole lot of paint on here, but I don't really need to do it. I'm not seeing any marks, any missed spots. I don't think I'm seeing any missed spots. No, it looks like we got total saturation. So hopefully this second coat's gonna go a lot faster than the first coat. That's what I'm hoping. And hopefully this light that Rabbit's putting up here is gonna work pretty good. What do you guys think? That look okay? You got to figure it out? Cool deal. All right. We'll be back in a minute to see if these lights work. Oh, my hand is killing me. All right. Super blurry in here because the light don't know where it's at. Cool deal. It is one o'clock. What time did we get over here? Like 11, right? Maybe 11. Yeah. Well, we got over here at 11 and here's where we're at. Uh, got the second coat of paint on not that back wall most of that's only got the first coat but i got the second coat all the way up to the trim line rabbit's been using the ladder so i need to get the trim line after he gets squared away and i've gone all the way down to that window right there that's where i'm at don't be smoking in the house and i've been back here working this way and now i'm currently in the hallway getting the first coat of paint up in here. I've hit here, up in there is really hard to get to. You can see the difference right there, starting to go over that way. So Rabbit had a hell of a time with this light right here. Uh, he's still not too sure about that. There's some wiring concerns that uh, we can't figure out. So he's working on that, but he just got this light up in here. Check out the ceiling fan, y'all. It's a nice looking little living room light. Starting to look like home already. One light down, two more to go. That one right there and that one right there, at least for in here. Oh yeah, and then we gotta get the drop down lights, which we don't have those yet. Definitely been on the grind, folks. Uh, paint is becoming a concern. How much paint do we have left? Uh, that's, that's it right there. I don't know if that's gonna, well, it's definitely not gonna do. Have you looked back to check and see if it's covering everything? Yeah, I got her ass, man. That second coat's getting it done. That might get me the first coat through the entire house. There's really not a whole hell of a lot left. And on this wall, I've gone to like right here at this door. I've still got to hit this major wall right here, hit that wall, hit the rest of that wall. But Rabbit's been in the way. I'm not trying to be in his way. So I've started in the hallway. Then we'll have this bedroom that needs to get done. And that bedroom there and the bathroom we're getting it knocked out folks slowly but surely all right well 2 30 almost 3 o'clock in the afternoon and we're gonna wrap it up for right now 
Uh, we got a little bit of stuff done, mostly painting this light here. It had issues with the other two lights, so we've taken those down. Uh, try to figure that out. And that's where we're at. So I got a second coat all the way around to about that light switch right there. I still got a hit to right here. And then I got the first coat in the hallway. And my God, look at those spots. Whew. So there's that. Got that done in just a couple of hours. But definitely got to come back and hit this a second time. So trying like all hell to get this place done but it's a hell of a lot of work wanted to share with you guys how this place is looking and i hope it's looking pretty good i mean we're starting to get the place cleaned up not a whole hell of a lot of messes anywhere this hallway floor this is a big deal right here and then the bathroom there was nobody over here working today other than rabbit and me uh, that's pretty frustrating but what are you going to do so we got a ceiling fan. That's what we got. We got a ceiling fan and a second coat of paint on a lot of walls and a first coat of paint on the hallway. You know, I actually told a story one time about hanging a ceiling fan. Kind of crazy. All right, well, hope this place is actually looking a little bit different, maybe even better. And I look forward to bringing you guys what comes next because it's major work and the rush is on. I don't know about the rush. We're trying to get this thing done by next week. That's my game plan, that's my hope, so we'll see.